Follow the owl thing. It's not a life stream, right? Probably to the left here. What? The items disappear? I should have grabbed them first. Cloud, by analyzing the life spring data, I was able to locate an old Republic transmitter chip. It can be found within a derelict structure that sits upon the coastline. This area is modeled with craters resulting from intense warfare between the Republic and Shinra. Do mind your step as you proceed. Goodness. This photo spots here, right? How do I, I just want to take the photo? Exposure, tilt, angle, camera position, frame. Oh, cool. Get those Instagram filters? Yeah. I think I actually took the photo, but I just got here. Who knows? It's done. Okay. Condor quest. All those willing to fight against Shinra's tyranny. We're gonna reclaim these waters and make them beautiful. Take a quick left out of here. Claire's really lucky. We're building a new republic. Don't know what that means. Welcome to the crow's nest. Pretty people of us. Crow's nest, right. listen. We're listening. We hear you. Look at us. Hello there, everyone. Eh? the right way yeah yeah we are 
I need to use that focus thrust ability more. If I master it. Oh, care to join us, young lady? We've got a lovely breeze blowing today. You certainly do. So, what are you all looking at? We're on the lookout for the Great Condor. We try to catch sight of it every time it takes flight, make sure it's in good health and all that. It's not really a danger to people, but its hunger can drive it to hunt larger prey. Let's just hope it never develops a taste for us. Surely you've seen our newsletter, haven't you? It's filled with fun facts about our beloved bird. I'm quite proud of it. Sir, I don't think the condor is going to show today. Maybe we should head back. No, let's wait a little longer, lad. That bird's got me a bit worried. Haven't seen it in a fair while now. I wonder if we should have given it something to eat after all. Perhaps. I put a post up on the notice board asking for help, but, um... Well, if you're still looking for volunteers, we'd be more than happy to help. Well, far be it for me to turn down such an offer. It's a proud creature, a hunter at heart. We've tried to feed it before, but it seems to prefer catching its own prey. If something smelled enticing enough, though, it might be moved to come and take a closer look, I suspect. Thank you. I appreciate it. One of the condor's favorite hunting spots is in the woods nearby. You'll need a chocobo that can manage the climb to get there. It's pretty tough. Ugh. Oh, nice! Maybe it's from the Chocobo. Medals. Holy. Alert! Alert! Dangerous being detected in your vicinity. Please ensure you are prepared before engaging. <laughs> My sensors are picking up some understandable confusion. Who the heck are you? It's a pleasure to meet you, Cloud. I am your personal monster assessment instrument. But since that's a mouthful, you can call me Mai. Chadley programmed me to assist you by providing detailed analyses of the fiends you encounter. I hope I can be of service to you in the many battles ahead. With that out of the way, I'm picking up unusual fiend activity nearby. To procure the biological data that we require, you'll need to complete specific objectives during combat. But don't worry, because I'll be here to help you succeed. Good luck! Run this place. Ray identified. Commencing guidance protocol. Sensolets are known as the 
Sieges of the Skies, not only because of their intelligence, but also their remarkable feathers that make them both elegant and lethal. These feathers have been guarded by all manner of costumes in antiquity for their beauty and Good enough. How do I get down there? Interior for Chadley. There's a lot in this area. Get him! Sorry, 
but I got I won't let you down. Bless them with your love and grace. Yeah! Perfect timing. Game's all about staggering. world. How? You're about to have a bad day. There goes the Condor's dinner. Maybe we can track its scent. Google hideout around her somewhere. Get off. Approach from behind. Ah! Don't attack the cow! You're dead! Probably just using focus to rush. Try this. That's a condor. That's a mi mini Bahamut. <laughs> Chocobo could track him.
terrain was like vicious. I hear you. Guess it's in here. Let's go. Don't mind if I get you up lunch. Dragon. <laughs> Allow me. Don't overdo it. I'll show you what I can do. One more shot. You're blown away. Ah! Myself. After you. I'm coming. Too much? Get ready. Almost dead. Can Come you on. Take over Give for me? I got this. Oh just cool. No Finisher. What do we do now?
What do you mean choose one? Why can't I take both? I think the monsters of flesh. Oh wait. Peculiar greens. Gotta take the peculiar greens. What about those? Better than nothing, right? It wasn't too much trouble. You can put the food right over there. Thank you. Did I choose wisely? Are those greens? Hmm. I can't say I've ever seen it feast on anything except me, but... Gotta say, it's kinda nice, looking up and seeing a blue sky. Beats a steel one, that's for sure. <laughs> Though at least with the steel sky you know your limits. Out here, it's endless. I kinda get what Aerith was saying now. Yeah, maybe. Hey, look! Hmm? <sighs> what a sight! I never dreamed I'd be able to see it up close like this. Ah. Uh, up. Oh, wait. We have to get a photograph. Grab the camera. Yes, sir. Come on. <laughs> Gather around, everyone. Quickly. Quickly. Say cheese. Oh. <laughs> what? So, snap any good shots? I hope so. It just showed up. I could barely hold my camera and... Really? Couldn't tell from a shot like this. Ah. <laughs> well, I haven't looked this happy since I was a lad. It's precious moments like these that make condor watching so exhilarating. You never know what to expect. Well, Scouts, let's finish writing up today's report and start preparing for our next fateful encounter. Sir! And hopefully next time we'll be able to snap a clear picture of that bird. Sir! Miss? I'd like you to have this as a souvenir. <laughs> <laughs> nice face, Cloud. I guess we chose poorly. Gotta go visit these Moogles. <laughs> Spring first, I guess. Come on. Oh, 
Let us partake of the planet's wisdom. Okay, try this again. Want to hang out with the Moogle? You betcha. In the fairy tale land. Would you mind rounding up all the mooglets for me? Bunch of troublemakers. Oh. Hey! Oh, cool. <laughs> Yo, grab them. Oh, bananas. Banana peels. Come here. It's so much easier when you just grab them. lot of Google things now. Everything's spinning. Don't mind me some cool stuff. Thanks so much, Koopa. I really can't thank you enough for bringing all the Mooglets back. It's such a relief the Emporium that Mog and Mag built together won't have to close down. You're a lifesaver, Koopo! Koopo! Please shop to your heart's content, Koopo! Earrings. Good. 
come again soon. I'm assuming it just automatically gets Over applied, right? Those books, I don't have to read them. Hopefully. Community notice board. Thunder Junon. Hey, what were you thinking sending Sam back alone like that? He even need us in the first place? Your mother'd give Stamp a run for his money. <laughs> so, how's my son? Seem okay? Yeah. You gonna stand there and pretend this wasn't all about Claire and her bun in the oven? <laughs> Apple didn't fall far from this stubborn ass tree. That's for damn sure. <laughs> Wouldn't know about that. And if you're done making wisecracks, I got work to do. Dude, that was like, <laughs> they're like millionaires. <laughs> that bounty was way too much. Or you won't do this quest, but we're just gonna go pick it up. Brittle houses. Oh yeah, I can get a photo. Hey there. Thank you for tracking down that spot. Quite the view you captured. You did me a good turn. I convinced the association to me. Of course, you're starting on the bottom row. And the more locations you find, the faster you'll climb that ladder. Isn't Priscilla just a I guess there's some kind of... Do you need something delivered? Place the board. Do it later. Switch for Scylla. When was the last time you all felt safe eating your We talked to Yuffie. She said that you could show us a way to get up top. Sure, I'd be happy to. Although, Yuffie's the one who found it. And according to her, that tanker's the quickest and easiest way into the city. See that? That booth up there is the control room. So we can repurpose this ship as an elevator. Someone lowers and sends it back up, along with the others. Problem is, how are we supposed to get to the controls? High voltage? Yep, it should just say no climbing. So we're stuck? Not with Mr. Dolphin. You wouldn't believe what he can do. Like, like when we met. See, I was out taking a swim all on my lonesome. At least I thought I was alone, but then Squeak, squeak! I hear this funny noise. That's great and all, but we're in a hurry. Hey! We're sorry, really. But we'll make sure to come back as soon as we're done. You can finish your story then. How does that sound? Okay, promise! <laughs> hmm? Never done it before? My arm, your arm, bam! Oh, gotcha! <laughs> Awesome. All right then. Now what? Now we ask Mr. Dolphin to get you up. With his help, it'll be a cinch. Okay. Which one of you wants to go flying? The lightest one. Got you written all over it, Merc. That'll be two thousand. I guess it's me. Great. Just let me know when you're ready to go. Uh. Just let me know, okay? Okay then. Well. If I can't come back for a while, that means I have to do this quest. Apologies. Apologies. Lately I've been bringing in nothing but didn't realize it was a one-way trip. We might as well do the side quest then.
of it. Oh. Uh, hello? Hey, what do you think you're doing here? This is a no grown up zone. Get lost. You're a kid? Well, duh. It's just how this place is. I don't know if it's because of the reactor out there or what, but hanging out here turns you into a frog. Hey, Finn, who are they? Not Shinra, I hope. Oh, no, we're definitely not. Oh, wait. You must be the ones Priscilla was talking about. She told me how you saved her. Right, that's us. We're friends. Are you a friend of hers, too? We're friends, but it's not like I like her or anything. It's just, there aren't a lot of other kids in the village, so I basically had to be your friend. <laughs> of course. So what are you kids doing all the way down here? Uh, playing Jump Frog, obviously. Actually, we could use a couple more players. Since you're here, do you want to give it a try? <laughs> Help us! <laughs> Come on, Cloud. Ribbit? Tifa! I tried to warn you! Like I said, hanging out here turns you into a frog! But don't worry, all you gotta do is start thinking like a frog, and you'll be fine! Ribbit, ribbit. Look at that sword! So silly. How do you heal? You can do it, Barrett. It's all you have to do, dude. So it makes these bubbles, and that's how I heal myself. Death. Thanks for that. So, ready to play? Come on, I love it. I promise. Ribbit? Ribbit. Okay, here are the rules. The 
think you two can handle it? You're just jumping? It's like Fall Guys. But as frogs. Oh. Look at that hang time. harder no oh! I see what do you think it's pretty fun right yeah I've played worse anyway thanks again for your help you can come back again if you want you look like you're having fun rip it <laughs> I could get used to it yeah I wouldn't go that far Tifa you ain't rip weird it, stuff <laughs> Ribbit. Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. <laughs> Almost died from a freaking mini game. <laughs> Stairs. Hope the crow's nest folks don't. That dolphin's so adorable. All right, everyone, come and get it. Don't want to make it. Elevator's been shut down since shit hit the fan. <laughs> you wouldn't believe how quiet these waters are. Follow that tuna. So we want to crash into the beach balls? Drift. Oh, those beach balls. Again, I'm excited. Ah! Got 10 seconds to fill up that bar. Nice going, 
wasn't the smoothest run, but we made it. Stuck the superhero landing. Huge help, Priscilla. No prob. Well, guys and girls, and uh, dog. I'll see you later. <laughs> Have fun. <laughs> hey. We're good to go down here! Wow. All aboard the Cloud Express! Go cannon! move. Infiltration mission. I can't believe we get to see the new president in person. Wow. security than I thought. More worried about the parade? <laughs> Guess things have changed. 
They got higher priorities. Personally, I think that's a good thing. The city's size, on the other hand. The robed men won't be easy to find. They're definitely not here. Let's head into town. We cannot let Midgar win. Any idea what that is? The high wind. Shinra's pride and joy. The fastest, most advanced airship in the fleet. Screw the boat. Let's take that. Unless you got a trained crew and piloting skills we don't know about, we're sticking with the boat. That's too bad. Would have been hurt. Hey, beggars can't be choosers. <laughs> No, we'll leave them be, for now. <laughs> Enter. An emissary from Wutai is here, sent by Viceroy Saruf. Oh? He introduced himself as Colonel Glenn Ladbrock. I thought you were dead. <laughs> then you thought right. Let's cut to the chase, Mr. President. The Viceroy and your late father had big plans. I assume you intend to carry them out? Correct. That's good to hear. Some people just don't have the stomach for war. And this battle for the Magnus Materia demands commitment from both Wutai and Shinra. Thank you, I'm aware. But my father is dead, which changes the equation. A new vision is required. You always did prefer to march to the beat of your own drum. This new vision include your fairy tale promised land? <laughs> you Shinras, you take and you take, and you never give back. Left to you, this world would end up an empty husk. But war can put things right. Beget anger, desolation, hatred, and in its wake, new unity. A people rejuvenated, and a planet once more made whole. What we're doing's for the greater good. Just gotta know when to ease off the gas. Now listen. You started this, remember? No more playing the idle air. You have obligations to fulfill. 
Let's give the people what they deserve. Oh, right. Before I leave, a message from the Viceroy. Congratulations on your inauguration, Mr. President. Shinra has a bright future. Trey 